okay, here's our turtles and their hibernation process. We're going to be giving them a better tank. There's the male. You can see him kind of scurrying off. And here's female. She's just kind of chilling. She's a little more social than the male is. And uh, they were in the pond this year, and we didn't suffer any fatalities, but they did kind of nip the crap out of some of the fish a little bit. So we're going to wait till the fish get quite a bit bigger before trying to toss them back in. So the immediate solution is that in the early spring, before the tropicals can go in, turtles are going to go in. Hopefully they'll lay some eggs. i got an area for that. And, you know, if they don't, they don't. And um, then in the fall, they're going to go in until it starts becoming winter, and then they're going to come in the house. Um, the turtles did stay out this year until um, late October. And this here is the big tank that I'm going to be putting them in eventually here. I'm going to be doing it up so that one half is divided by land, the other half is water, so that they don't try to lay eggs in the water like they did in the spring and salmonella poison themselves like they did. After two days of tetracycline, uh, you know, they recovered just fine, but silly ass turtles trying to lay eggs in the water. What the heck's wrong with these guys? So we're going to rectify that situation. I got the aquarium safe bow corning stuff on order, and that's going to our free sample of it to make sure it's the right stuff. One bottle is going to be here in like two weeks, and then we can order like going to order like two cases of it. But um, yeah, that's what I need to do the divide because we got to put a piece of glass in between there to divide it up and so on and so forth. Going to use the grinder over at uh, one of my clients, computer clients, Joseph's Jewelers, uh, right down the way from uh, Ocean Design in Dunning Square. Going to use this grinder to make it the glass smooth so it doesn't have any sharp edges. And then just silicone the thing into the other tank to divide the land and the water. Now, these turtles are pretty neat. I, I hope they breed. Um, they are a mated pair, obviously. So I really do hope that they breed. That would be really cool. Really neat.